Comparing prices. It is very important that when you go shopping, you understand the value of comparing prices. There are bargains where you can save much money. If you understand how to do your math, let's plan a vacation and use our math skills. You decide you want to take a vacation on the ocean where you can walk along the beach, see the beauties of nature, go swimming, and watch the sunset. You get one package that offers you a round trip airline flight, hotel room for seven days, and breakfast for $1,459. Another airline has a round trip flight for $359. You locate a hotel with the same rating for $125 a night, which would be the best deal for one week's vacation. Let's do the math. You have an offer A, airline flight, hotel for seven days, and breakfast all included $1,459. You have another offer B, the airline flight costs $359, hotel with breakfast $125 a night. The question, which would be the best deal for one week vacation? Offer A or offer B? This, we have to do the math. This has all the math in it. The whole cost for airline flight, hotel for seven days and breakfast, $1,459. Here we have to do some math. Now the first thing we're going to do is hotel with breakfast is $125 a night and it's for seven days. So we have to add $125 seven times. And let me just say this. The next book will be on multiplication and we would use multiplication, but since we haven't covered mul multiplication, we'll do addition. So we got to add 125 seven times. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So let's do the math. Five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35. 3 plus 2 is 5, plus 2 is 7, 9, 11, 13, 15, 17. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So the hotel with breakfast would cost $875. Now the airline flight is $350. So you have to add 359 onto it plus 359. So 9 plus 5 is 14. 8 plus 1 plus 7 is 8, plus 5 is 13. 1 plus 8 is 9, plus 3 is 12. So offer B is $1,234, and offer A is $1,459. So obviously, offer B is much cheaper. Let's see how much money we, we save with that. So we can deduct then 1,234 from 1,459, 1,234, 4 from 9 is 5, 3 from 5 is 2, 2 from 4 is 2. So you would save $225 with offer B. And I want to stress, learn to use your math skills. You'll save lots of money doing that. And I want to point out, now this was kind of lengthy. Now this was addition. You know how to do addition. You know how to do subtraction. And the next book is on multiplication. You're not going to start with these big numbers right away. You'll do, you just learn a multiplication table, a lot of simple numbers. This is, when you multiply numbers like this, that's in the higher multiplication at the towards more the end of the book. But again, it makes it, it's really multiplication is speed addition. That's really what it is. So take the final exam. And if you need any more help, there's additional helps and additional tests in the book. And we'll see you in book number three, multiplication. Please work the problems and take the test in your workbook. Number success, the practical way to learn.